My name is Rasha Hamza. I'm the chair of SP Education and Training Committee. Education is one of the main missions of SP. Our committee offers a lot of educational activities and opportunities. To start with, we have two core schools. This is the winter school and the summer school. The winter school is for beginners or early career delegates who have completed their pediatric training and intending to continue in the field of pediatric endocrinology. In contrast, the summer school is a high level school for advanced trainees. In addition, we also have a specialized school, which is the DOM school, diabetes, obesity, and metabolism school. And we have schools according to various geographical areas. For example, we have the CNCA school, which is designed for Russian-speaking delegates. We have the Maghreb school for French-speaking delegates and the Aspid SP and the Crime Academy, which is an intellectual teaching course for candidates practicing in Arab countries. Our course also extends beyond to African countries. We have the PETCA program, and this is pediatric endocrine training for Central African colleagues, and the PETQA, extending more into West Africa as well. In addition, we have some advanced programs. We have the e-learning program, which is a free online program offered digital learning free of charge for everyone to learn more in the field of pediatric endocrinology and diabetes. We also have the clinical fellowship, which is an advanced program. It's in the form of a three month visit. The fellows visit certain countries according to their language, and they practice in a center of excellence under the supervision of an expert in the field of pediatric endocrinology. And again, this is paid by the SP as well. We also have the accreditation and syllabus. And uh, this is to let you know that the syllabus was recently updated last year. And this guides pediatric endocrine trainees on the syllabus all over Europe and even beyond. Last but not least, we have the SP Connect webinar series. And this offers a high quality educational content for all SP members in the field of pediatric endocrinology, diabetes, bone, and obesity as well. In addition to all the activities that I have listed, we have some future projects that we are working on, like implementing a bone school, a transition course, therapy area master classes, and SP snippets. We have a lot to offer in the ETC. And also there is the Yes group webinars, which are going to be published. We already published two Yes guided webinars, and we're planning to have a series of webinar dedicated for the Yes group members. And this is the young SP members. In fact, SP offered a lot, and especially education. And the feedback we received from most of the students attending the school is that they will always remain attached to ESPI and all its activities.